Hello there, Madre Hill. We're back with E4 Burgundy. I need to make sure to remember to make sure I do the Golden Age because this will be the time to get it. I must never use Golden Age. I always think I should save them later and never grant them. It's like, they're like potions in freaking video games, aren't they? You know, you're always like, ah, uh, I'll use this at some point, right? So we're going to set everybody to aggressive now. And they have a lot of soldiers. And this will just mean that we'll be sieging things till Kingdom Come, which is great. Ooh, that's not good. England's just declared war on Armagnac. I was going to vassalize them. Ain't that distressing. <laughs> that's fine. It means actually I can return a lot of cores to them. So that's good. And in fact, this is all cores of Armagnac, so I will return cores like crazy. Okay. Again, I do just kind of want to peace out with Castile, but... I want to wait, because there's so much more we could get here. And again, we're just going to look at the AE here. Pretty good. I mean, we could get something like... Anything here that's actually claimed by someone else? Gascony, France, Burgundy. We could take things like Wato, which is a natural harbor, but for something I don't care about. Damn, damn, damn. Okay. We're going to annex Orleans, which is good. All right, Avignon has a claim on it. Oh, no. Armagnac. Oh, great. No, Armagnac has a claim on it, but that's fine. I don't really care about what Armagnac has a claim on. So I, could, I guess I'll just take these three. And if I do that, the coalition is the size of Kingdom Come. Okay. 31. 35. 24. Okay, I could take Limousine. Armagnac. No one cares about it. Literally no one. Uh, it's only 24 AE, so that's pretty good. I do very much want to balkanize Castile, so I do kind of want to just stay in this war for a very long time, or at least as long as I can, and try to just try and break him up as much as I can. My hope is that the AI will help me out in this endeavor. Okay, so we're going to keep one relation boy there. Good. He's good. Um... I'm also going to improve relations of Armagnac so I can vassalize them quite liquidly. Uh, Vatican infiltration, let them out of job or gain five influence. Hells to the air. Give me that damn influence, you sod. I gain 6.59 per year. Yeah. Plus, the longer the war goes on for the more AE goes down. You finish by 59 for the AE bonus. Exact. 1508, actually. 1508. Whoa, what are you doing? What is you doing, guys? You can't win that on your own. Oh, maybe you can. Oh, you can. Okay, well, screw me. I can just shut up, can't I? I don't know what the hell I'm doing. They've clearly got this on their own. Did your game crash, Olivia? Oh, no, reload, reload. It saves every couple turns. Why is... Uh, for some reason... I mean, if anyone knows about this, Civ on Mac has been crashing a lot recently. And I know it's been driving Olivia to thoughts of burning down. It was Steam crashed. I can disable that for you, Olivia. I will disable that for you. Ooh, that's a common bug, actually. I will disable that. I have downloads turned off when I'm playing games. Remind me later, and I'll turn that down. I'll turn that off, even. No problem. Should I, that, you know what? That's my bad. It should have already been turned off. Yes, it is. It's all my own fault. <laughs> England attacking seems great. Vassalizing the Warving or Dragon defensive war where you can call allies for free. No perpetual muse because I need England as a vassal. I have to keep England as a vassal because they're the only powerful country who would support me when I start to go mental and attack things. If I try to go for England, first of all, I don't have a lot of claims on them. Second of all, if I try to go for England right now, I end up with a person who gets billions of AE on me. Because remember, allies get 50% AE from anything you do, right? Usually valuable. And that's after all other modifiers. It's not 50% including all the other bonuses. It's 50%. It, it does all the percentages away from AE, and then it takes 50% off that. So it's massive. That's why he only has 20. That's why he only has 16 AE, despite watching me conquer everything, like quintuple my size. So I need a really strong vassal, uh, ally even, 
nearby. Oh, you just got here. Oh, no worries, buddy. No worries. But it's a good time to explain the general strategy anyway. The goal of Perpetual Muse is to somehow use England as a kind of springboard when having to fight Austria. I don't know if I will be able to, per se, but it's worth it. It's also one of the reasons why I'm trying to heavily use Austrian forces in the fight, just to weaken them overall. Um, I can't even start any wars because I have a reason to get that end soon. I don't know how much debt England has, actually. I, I could find out quite easy if I can't bother to and how is the Castile doing? Oh my god, look, look at Austria. They're just doing work. They just don't give a shit, do they? They're just messing things up. Yeah, it was 2.7k debt in the most recent check, yeah. Which I think is hilarious. What about your manpower? When do you want to secure the throne mission? You won't you have to fight it, or are you going to have to wait to activate it? So you can activate the mission whenever you want. I just have to be at peace and have to reach 1500 without triggering it. But that's going to then give me a myriad of things. I have to then immediately get rid of my alliance with Austria and in fact rival them if at all possible. Hence why I'm keeping a rival slot open. And just make them pissed off as much as possible. And as long as I can get them to minus 125 in relations very quickly, then I should be fine. Um, yeah, that's about it basically. Just kind of make him really pissed off at me. And then I can get a lot of CPs. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, they ain't never cantering a call for it caught arms again. Literally ever. Uh, you go down there. You go up here. Where are they retreating to? Over. Let's get them. Let's try and do some stacky wipes. That's actually a mountains, but they have like no morale, so we might actually get them. Oh, never mind. They've gone southwest, so that's fine. Okay. And as you can see, my lovely allies are just doing, or, and my vassal swarm are just doing so much work. Having a vassal swarm is just like, it's not, I'm not going to say it's easy mode, but my god, does it make things easy, right? There's still a lot of difficulty in it, but oh, it's just so great. Okay, I want all their money. I want all your war reps. I, I do want to balkanize them, but humiliating them is also so beautiful. I can only release Navarre if I do that, though. If I get rid of the Humiliate, because I already would, I already do get power protection. Don't I? I don't. That's lame. Oh, man. Come on. Everything is so expensive, that's why. I just lower it to 20. I can make them release Galicia or Astorius. I guess I'll make them release Galicia. I just want to make them weaker. This is the thing. I just want to weaken them. Humiliating them would be better for me, but weakening Castile is better in the long run. Removing their dev, making them less effective as fighters, it's just better. Uh, everyone's not the siege. Yosef. Let's go. Okay. Oh, he's infertile. Interesting. So, I mean, I guess I probably am going to keep the Royal Marriage of England for quite a while. So let's keep that that there. Single so, Yeah, exactly, Broken Sky. If I'm staying outside of England, why not accept the marriage proposals? Precisely. As I've done. He caught it just as I was thinking that. We'll probably get eaten by England as it borders them. Yep, they've already been eaten. They were already being attacked. I will be offering vassalization of them extremely shortly. And then returning cause as soon as possible. They have claims there. Ooh. Ooh, that'll be good. Okay, so what if I did this instead? Um, What if I did, like this no i no it's okay what if i yeah what if i did that what kind of ae is that that's not too bad good point luke leash is probably better yeah i did that that's 38 so that's pretty bad a couple of years more and i could do that and i could return court and zebios thank you very much the father welcome to the stream oh no foy is a vassal under england damn never mind then 
Because these are these are claims of Armagnacs, so never mind. I don't want to take anything that they've got a claim on, because it'd be easy just to give to them. Or don't take much that they have a claim on. Because that's only 24. I don't want too much AE, but I also do want power. Great. Uh, Asturias Knight. Oh, right, sorry. Oh, that's true. You're absolutely right. Yeah, if I did release Astorius, they'd just get gobbled up. So probably something like Galicia would be better. And then I'm probably... I, I don't mind the France Alliance. I don't mind that at all because they're quite weak. And then War Reps and then just as much... Give me that. Money as I can get. Uh, I'm doing this mission just to give admin points to a couple things. That's the general goal. Not too bad. Okay. Do 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 and again, my boys are just kicking butt. Minus forty four right now. I don't have call for peace yet, so I'm just gonna keep sitting here. Annoyingly, Austria does in f you know now that I think about it, maybe I should have gone military. It is it's too late now though. Austria does have a lot of stuff. They have. They got a military idea? No, just administrative. They have their base ideas, which is not great. But remember, I do have morale of armies 10%. I wonder if I should probably go mill ideas next. Right. Oh, many vassals. Oh, many vassals. Ba, ba, ba. Okay. Oh, the amount of stuff I've got really is increased. Nice. Try and get some power. My boys are the boys are doing stuff, that's for sure. I think I need to be hiring mercenaries, honestly. Like I know I don't I don't have a lot of money, this is the problem. Urgh. And there's the birth of colonialism. Alright, where is that? One day I will remember where the damn development mode is the institutions. I was looking for the wrong one. It's institutions, isn't it? Okay, so the Renaissance is there and ooh, it is over here. Okay. That's unfortunate, because I don't have any coastal provinces that I can spread to. Damn, that's gonna take a long time. Because it is nearby friendly province and new old nation or port neighboring province. Damn. Not good. Uh, I need a port. I need a port. Maybe taking Montpellier would be a good idea. Instead of another country. Oh, it's 42 though. Ow, ow, ow. That is unpleasant. I wonder if I should just release Gascony and try and return cause that way. But it's fine, we're already here with Avignon. Um, that, that would be 35, and that's just too much. It's fine, it'll just spread a little bit slower. You, Castile, break time to peace out, let's go. Come on, chap. Off you go. Oh my god, Austria is just destroying them. They don't even have a chance, do they? They're getting wrecked. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I love it. Oh, look, they're going to walk onto mountains. Cardinal Minister. Yes. Regency Council does not need his advice. Ah, yes. Regency Council cares not. Oh, bye, Castile. Look at that. They're just getting stack wiped. Okay. What's their war exhaustion right now? Oh, it's it's not low. It's it's not low. Okay, we release Galicia. They give me their war reps. I get a big pile of money. The points are almost full. That's very true. Their unrest is pretty high. Actually, only 4.5. But I am starting to get called for peace. So I think I will peace out. I don't really want to have any more war exhaustion that I have to. Um, I do have a little bit of separatists I need to consider myself. Oops. Just the general piece there. Great. 
Pretty good. Give me a big pile of cash. I can hire some mercs with that. I only get two power projections, which sucks, but... Wow. Almost 100,000 dead on our side against only 86,000 of theirs. That is distressing. <laughs> to say the least. Gosh darn. Let's try and not go through Orleans, shall we? That is a bloody idea. Okay, if I take even just the three of those provinces, I still get a pretty significant coalition. Pretty significant. Feedback Gaming, welcome to the stream, buddy. How you doing, my friend? P-U-H-R-E. That's the plan, yes, but at the moment I have too much AE for it. Just too much AE. I have a lot of quite decent vassals, though, which is nice. Pretty decent. Well, pretty decent. I have Dauphin, Berry, and Orleans. I think annexing them wouldn't be the worst idea either. Okay, so... If I were to do this, which is just taking only three provinces, three wafer-thin provinces, um, I'd still get a pretty sizable coalition, so I'm going to wait for Württemberg to bugger off. I'm going to wait for the year tick. Or it's a smaller France. This is true, yeah. I'm going to wait for the year tick. For Württemberg to go away. Or should I just peace out, because I'm getting a lot of cool for peace. Well, only a little bit, but... All right, if I did that, how long till the age ends? It's 71 months, so it's a fair bit of time. Okay. 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 I'm gonna grow decently here, which is nice. Steel has insulted us. Ow. Hurtful. Very hurtful. I think I should just do it now. I'm getting impatient, frankly. Um, I don't mind the alliance of Castile. If I don't, if I get rid of that, I, I just don't want to. I want, I want Castile to still be involved in this fight, because it means I can beat them up and hurt them. Um, I'm going to make them steer trade to me, because there's a fair amount of trade here, and I want them to give that to me. Although, if I got rid of it, I could get a lot more actually. Transfer trade power. Now that's a bit better. Although, actually, I have all my merchants in the east, so transferring trade power is essentially useless. Can they release anything else? They could release Avignon, but I'm about to conquer that, basically. I could take Avignon instead, but Armagnac has a claim on it. I think I'd rather that. Yeah. God, I have, like, no room for AE, though. Just so much. So I still have 65. So I guess I could just do it. Revoke I could do revoke cause. But honestly, I'd rather go. I guess end rivalry makes more sense, doesn't it? Something like that. There we go. Pretty good. Just for that prestige bonus. Because it just gives me a big pile of prestige. Alright, let's go. Ooh. Almost a hundred thousand events, a hundred and seven thousand. Hmm, border gore. Hey, Armagnac, you want to be friends? Ooh, Babu Barman, thank you very much for the follow. That was a very difficult name to say. We're going to improve relations with these guys. Unfortunately, I did just get a big pile of AE with them, uh, which is probably slowing down my ability to love them. Uh, we can do the succession, but I very much don't want to yet because that'll be a problem. It, it'll be a problem. Uh, Vatican infiltration. Ooh, more people influence. And Superfish following as well. Thanks, buddy. I really appreciate that. Welcome to the stream. How you doing? Ooh, we could do another thing. I think I should probably try and get some more Curia Control bonuses, though. And we're going to grab these cores. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And we can actually upgrade our government rank. Ooh, hello. We're at Kingdom now, baby. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. And we can make some states. Nice. Oh god. Please don't... Please don't kill their rebels. Thank you. And now we're going to annex Orleans. You. That will be done on... 
Uh, da -da 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 -da. 1507, it's only five years. Differing levels of how much you know you're in charge. That's, that's fair. Ah, oh, man. They hate me now because of all the AE. Crap. That is so annoying. Really wish I could have got their alliance earlier. Ah, oh, man. What? 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 What was that? I just got a CB. Restoration of Union Casus Belly. They just broke off. No, they didn't. What? Oh, talking about? I am in the process of annexing them. Hey, that's a weird bug. That's a very weird bug. That. <laughs> okay. Um. Yeah, royal marriage from Armagnac. I guess we could just give them a gift, but the problem is, is that a gift only gives you a maximum of 25 relations. And that only gets me to 175, so I still need to get 32 relations. Levin's YouTube, I'm playing Austria. Can you give me some tips? Um, playing Austria in this patch is, frankly, insanely ridiculous and uh, should be nerfed. And it's disgusting. So abuse it as much as you can. That would be my advice. <laughs> it's so, so good. It's almost unbelievable how good it is. It's so easy to revoke. Uh, conquer countries, attack countries, and force them to release countries, and then invite those countries into the HRE. You get 10 points. That's it. That's all you need to know. In the next episode, I am going to be waiting for AE to tick down and hopefully vassalizing Armagnac, and also before the end of the Age of Discovery, triggering my Golden Age, and also before the Age of 1509, putting points in thingy for this. Bye-bye.